Hi there! In the Single Transferable Vote System, or STV, Parliament consists of 120 seats, and New Zealand is divided up into about 27 electorates. Depending on how many people live there, each will have between 3 and 7 MPs. Each party can have more than one candidate. To vote, you choose your most preferred candidate and, if you want, your second, third, fourth choice from any party, as well as independents, as many as you like. Or instead, you can vote for your preferred party and accept its choice of candidate rankings. To win, candidates must get a minimum number of votes. This number is called the quota and varies in each electorate, depending on how many votes and how many MPs there are. If an Apple Party candidate gets more votes than they need to be elected, their voters' second choices are now in play. In this example, most of these extra votes go to another candidate from the Apple Party, so he too is elected. But there is still one seat to fill, so the lowest polling candidate is eliminated, and those votes go to his voters' second choices, who are as yet unelected. The Cherry Party's candidate is the last MP to be elected. Under STV, it's likely that the party's share of the total seats will roughly reflect their share of the total votes. So, smaller parties and independent candidates with strong local support can be elected to Parliament. Under the STV voting system, governments are often made up of more than one party in coalition, or with support agreements. And that's STV!